I heard you're a super huge fan of Lady Gaga. <laughs> what do you th- what did you think yeah. of her performance with Metallica? Um, I, you know what? I didn't see it because I refuse. Um, I'm a, I'm a Metallica fan, and, and I, I would rather listen to the new album than see anything they do with her. Um, you know, she's just annoying, man. She's, 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 she's a cheap Madonna clone, um, <laughs> and somehow she's, she's, she's managed to con the world that she's this original, uh, thought-provoking artist. And, of course, she, this whole thing that, that's happened recently <clears throat> where... Um, it's now cool to come out and say, okay, you were, you were molested as a kid. I mean, you know, it's one thing to come out and, and say it when, when, you, when you mean it and, and it's a heartfelt thing, but somehow with her, everything she does just doesn't feel genuine. And let's not even get started on the fact that she won an Emmy for her performance in American Horror Story, and she was so bad. So I, I don't understand what the, what the appeal is there, but um, I you know, love she is and she, she's... She's left her mark on the pop world. So. I love the honesty. Um, you know, I'm just at the point now where pulling punches just doesn't seem like it's, 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 it's even worth it anymore. So, yeah, I mean, like I said, she's, I find her overrated and, and whatever. But, uh, <laughs> and you know what? And, and, and I think that's important in, in this politically correct uh, culture that we live in, um, where you have to tiptoe around a conversation because you don't want to offend somebody. I mean, God forbid you offend somebody. And, and you know, if you think about it, at the end of the day, somebody's always going to be offended by something you say. So I might as well just say what I, what I have to say rather than pretend that the whole world is just uh, hunky-dory. 